Okay, I think his name is Fang, Fang Wu. He or she, I have no idea because the avatar is not a person. Unless it's a self-portrait. What? That'd be crazy. Anyways, so I will start off by saying I am not a character artist, so I'll just say what feels weird. And then maybe you should look at this area because this area doesn't feel right to me, and I'm not sure why. <laughs> um, but maybe I should get better at that, huh? Prince of Persian. Make sure to uh, – you can go back and edit this and just make, make sure it says Prince of Persia. And then capitalize the P. Read, what did you do to me? What have you done to me? I'm all trying to correct grammar now and punctuation and ah oh. oh man anyway so this is a year ago and then the next piece is a year ago a year ago so these are all about a year ago and i think your profile said you were in, yeah you're in in south korea so a lot of this art is very like uh, man it sounds weird but korean art influenced like when I play Korean MMOs, the art style is very much this. Dude, that armor is freaking sick. Super cool. The attention to detail and the consistency of the size of shapes, leading from like larger shapes, larger shapes, and then where they get finite, and then, yeah, it's, it's good. And it's surprising that you can have so much detail here, and yet this area feels like an area of rest. I think on the side of the blade where it's smooth is, is really helping with that. Dude, that sword. Jesus. Like, is he going to even be able to get that out of the ground? Oh, yeah, I get it. he got it out of the ground. I mean, it's, it was pretty in there. That forearm strength. So one thing I would suggest is like... Um, really adding those kind of softer shadows that occur with hair, like where, where it's like, I'm like about to touch my face. Um, let's bring it over here. Oh, wow. Perfect framing. So like under the hair, you can see that like, there's not really much shadowing going on. There's a shadow coming from the nose, right? But getting that kind of ambient shadowing happening from the hair being draped over the face is going to be really key to, um, adding that kind of depth. And, and simulating the volume of the hair. What? What? Hang on, hang on. Oh, you're killing me. There it is. Yes. I would play that game. I would play that. This guy looks like he can wreck face. And it's me doing it, you know? Dang, dude, that's terrifying and awesome. Oh, wow, and the detail. So the smooth part of the blade becoming glowing hot, and then the detail in the center just holding holding its own. This is cool, man. This is super nice. So I'm curious as to why there's so many images. I guess maybe I, we're, we're doing it. Hang on here. It's just slightly different framing, different hair color, different lighting. Personally, I like this one, but I like the, the framing of the face on this one more just because this one doesn't look as flat. Like this one, the face is much flatter just because of the, the angle of it. But I mean, man, that's super cool. So this one is a year ago and this is three months ago, so you've definitely upgraded. This character is also very cool. I love the hood. Hood design is pretty sick. This is a year ago. Oh, is this from, I could be completely wrong, but Terra, like, like the MMO Terra? That a fun combat system. Man, the weight on this character, it's super, like, it's very Gears of War, you know what I'm saying? 
Wow, that is some work. Nice job. Yeah, so I think if you were to do anything on this character, it's finding ways to uh, take this pattern and make it not so busy. So that there's somewhere for the eyes to rest is going to be key because it's very detailed like throughout. Like the legs, you get a little bit of eye rest and then a little bit on the on the boots. But everything seems to have detail. Like if this was just like a leather pattern. And then like you saved this area up here for the chain, the chain mail. Like I think it w could possibly look better. I could be wrong as well. I'm just thinking about way about ways to give the eye areas to rest. Man, that's sick though. But yeah, I don't I mean I don't have too much else to say about is this the same same character? Dude, what are those? What are those? Hang on. They're like pistol daggers. That's freaking cool. Dude, those are cool. Like revolver daggers. Gun blades. It's like, what class are you going to play? I'm going to play gun blade. Pretty cool, though. Pretty cool. Yeah, I don't have too much else to say on it. I mean... Yeah, no, I'm terrible at characters. <laughs> Pistol daggers. But yeah, think about the hair thing I was talking about. And then, um, oh man, that face mask. Super cool. You're definitely leveling up with each piece. Because like, while I don't know what it is, there's something off about the face. Maybe it's the way that the cheekbones are structured to the jaw. Or the spacing of like the features of the face. But it over here, it's like way better. I need to learn characters. At least an understanding of them. Alright. Let's get on to the next portfolio. Thank you for sharing your portfolio. And I hope I was able to give you something. What's next? Dagger nukes? Wow. <laughs> wow. 